Here's your Daily Sports Rush from Sports Not for August 23rd, 2024. Welcome to the Daily Sports Rush from Sports Not, where we pack the hottest sports news into a two-minute blitz. I'm your host, Scott Branson, and we've got four stories today that'll leave you pumped. So let's get to it. The NFL preseason is wrapping up, and last night's action didn't disappoint, especially for Colts fans. Anthony Richardson was out there looking like a top five pick that he was meant to be. He kicked off things by completing seven out of eight passes for 65 yards, including a nine-yard touchdown to rookie Adani Mitchell. Now, don't get too excited. His accuracy took a nosedive afterward, but hey, it's the preseason, right? The Colts still walked away with a 27-14 win over the Bengals. And speaking of bombs, <laughs> let's talk about the Chiefs quarterback Ian Book. In the fourth quarter, he uncorked a beautiful 49-yard dart to Montreal, Washington who somehow, look at this, hauled it in between two defenders. Just some preseason magic before the Bears eventually took the game 34-21. In NFL trade news, yes, trade news, Washington Commander fans, brace yourself. The team just traded former first-round pick Jahan Dotson to the Philadelphia Eagles. Yes, you heard that right. Washington will get a third-round pick and two seventh-rounders in return. This move might leave you scratching your head, and for good reason. Dotson's production dipped in his second year but he never had a solid quarterback to throw to him in Washington. For the Eagles, it's a low-risk, high-reward situation as they hope to tap into Dotson's first-round potential. Trade grades, well, I'd give the Commanders a D- minus if they're lucky. And for the Eagles, boy, you got to give them, I think, an A- minus on this one. They're sitting pretty right there. All right, over in Kansas City, the Chiefs continue to lock down their talent. Center Creed Humphrey just signed a four-year, $72 million extension. This makes him the highest-paid center in the NFL. The guy's been a rock for Patrick Mahomes starting every single game since he was drafted. With two Super Bowl rings already, Humphrey's just getting started, and the Chiefs are showing they are all in on another Lombardi trophy. Finally, let's talk about some baseball drama. The Seattle Mariners have fired their manager, Scott Service, after a disastrous couple of months. The Mariners went from leading the AL West by 10 games to barely hanging on in the playoff race. Service found out about his firing from a news alert. Talk about a bad day at the office, yikes. The Mariners have turned to former catcher Dan Wilson to steer the ship the remainder of the season, but with just five weeks left in the year, it's gonna be hard to climb back in. All right, that is your Sports Rush for this Friday. Check out sportsnot.com for more of the biggest stories of the day, always. And I will catch you next time. Have a great weekend.